so I bought this book around two years ago, I think, uh, and I started it, almost got to the end, but then I kind of fell out of it, and that sucks, because it's, it's pretty good. Well, it's not that good, but it's, it's decent. But it's Doctor Who, and I love Doctor Who, especially because it's the ninth Doctor, and I can never get my fill of him. But actually, I read the book that preceded it, this one, uh, The Clockwise Man, which was actually the first Doctor Who novel of the Revived series. And this here is actually quite good. I really enjoyed it. I, I thought it was a good mystery. It was full of intrigue and excitement. It really went by quickly, like, especially compared to this one. I, I don't know why. But yeah, this one... Uh, the monsters inside, it's alright. It's it's good to just have more Ninth Doctor for me. But it's not as good as the Clockwise Man. And it's probably because, uh, spoiler alert, its main focus is on the best Russell T. Davies creation of all time, the Slitheen. Or rather, on Raxacorcophalopatorians, but, you know, what's the difference? Said the horrible racist that nobody liked? But yeah, Raxacorcophalopatorians are pretty bad, so that doesn't really help this book. And also I have this one, Winner Takes All, because I ordered all three of these at the same time, pretty much right after I finished up with the ninth. Because, you know, he was fantastic and I had to have more. But yeah, I still haven't read this because I haven't finished this one, and this one came out before this one. Not that they share any sort of continuity or anything, but whatever, I just want to follow the publishing date. I guess they do have kind of like a loose continuity tied to the show. Each book takes place between certain episodes, so so even though none of them share any elements with each other, including with the actual show, it still follows the show's pattern and assumes that you know things from the show in the order that the episodes go. I don't know if that makes any sense. I'm really just rambling here, but yeah, I guess that's my attempt at explaining the Doctor Who expanded universe. So that's cool, but uh, yeah, uh, it's, it's basically it. Uh, these Doctor Who books are cool on the simple merit that they feature the Ninth Doctor, and that's really all I need. Did I just do a book review? Kind of, I guess. Well, that's new. I did sort of enjoy it. Not really very concise in quality of a review, but uh, whatever. I did it. It's cool. Mm -hmm.